ongoing management board. You will be aware that this extraordinary management board meeting is linked to a report. There have been uh, developments with, in terms of of the uh, publishing of this letter by uh, its uh, head. That's new. So as long as this management board meeting is ongoing, we're not going to make uh, any comments. So that's the first point I'd like to make. Of course, the Commission's position is, and has always been, and Anita will provide you details on this as well, uh, is to do everything within its powers to make sure that the agency meets its mandate, uh, the whole of its mandate, and uh, within uh, the conditions uh, laid down. Now, you've also quoted what uh, Commissioner Margarita Skinner uh, said, uh, um, characterizing this as support to Mr. Legeri. And I listened carefully to what you said, to the quote, and he doesn't refer to the name of the director to the directors by name once. He talks about the agency. He's talking about the agency. And so it seems clear to me, therefore, that the Commission wants to see the agency working towards the achievements of its missions. If there are any weaknesses, well, then uh, something needs to be done to make sure that those are dealt with. Anita will talk to that. And I made this point uh, initially when I was quoting Jean Monnet. We are beyond the question of individuals now. We're also talking about a question of institutions. And it's on uh, that that the Commission is going to focus its work. Anita, perhaps you can give us a few examples of what we've done in the face of the criticism which has been levelled at us or the weaknesses which we've identified. Yes, of course. Thank you, Eric, and thank you, David. Um, yes, the Commission has always supported uh, action which would uh, improve the global functioning and the improvement of uh, fundamental rights within Frontex. I'd just like to give you an example of a number of different uh, actions we've undertaken. We, the uh, agency has a new uh, organisational structure. That's been the case since 2021. We have three deputy directors who have been uh, nominated are in, in uh, their posts today. After the, imp the implementation of the legislation relating to uh, Frontex, we've been uh, the commission has been looking at the uh, introduction of an independent system for the monitoring of fundamental rights within the agency. So we have a fundamental rights officer, and we have a deputy fundamental rights officer in situ, and we also have uh, you know people checking these fundamental rights issues.